Welcome back. Time is now 614. Now to the morning business report. So how is Connecticut doing for remote workers? Well, Channel 3's Jane King joins us now live at the NASDAQ with the answer for us. Good morning, Jane. Happy Friday. That's right. So happy Friday. So Wallet Hub ranks Connecticut pretty high for remote workers. It says the state is fourth best, in fact. Now it says Connecticut had among the highest number of homes with internet access. Now the best work from home conditions, they say, include low costs of internet, fast upload and download speeds, and a high level of security. Well, JP Morgan says we should be ready for a 40% increase in commodity prices. Now, that size of a rally from where we are now would take commodities like wheat and gas far into record territory. The bank highlighted oil and agricultural products in this analysis. Well, the IRS says remaining tax refunds could be delayed due to a worker shortage. The head of the agency says continuing fallout from the pandemic and the many tax changes in the federal relief measures likely to delay the refunds that have not yet gone out even more this year. And stocks bounced back yesterday. We did close higher. Weekly jobless claims fell to the lowest since 1968. But worries remain about interest rates. Does look like a higher start today, though. Life in the NASDAQ market site. I'm Jane King. Back to you. All right. Thanks, Jane.